Hello Commanders, Commander Plater here, back with another Elite Dangerous video. Today, I'm talking about how to make some easy money now Update 2.2's come in. Now, first of all, um, you're going to be needing to get yourself over to the Aretas Sector CQ-YD60 as a system. Now, we're going to be doing skimmer missions, so you do need to have Horizons. Uh, it's really important with this, because obviously that's why it's Update 2.2, not 1.7. So. Um, you're going to go to Cochrane Works, which is located on planet B6 in the system. Now, the system is unexplored when you get there, and these missions can be done in a ship of absolutely any size. I'm here in my Corvette, but to actually complete the missions and do them, I'm actually using my Taipan Fighter, uh, because it's a little bit easier down on the planet's surface. Now, what you're doing is you are mission stacking, and in particular I'm here picking ones for Kent's Inheritance. Now, the reason why I've chosen this one is because it's completely unprotected so the missions are going to be quite limited there aren't many for this particular one but as you can see here there are some other different um, locations around that you can do them for so you're going to pick out as many missions as you can then you're going to board hop and if you're not sure what that is and you're new to the game essentially you're changing game mode so you're going back to the main menu and once you're in the main menu you're then going to um, go back into the game and you're going to pick either open play or solo play depending on which one you're in before and then you're going to pick up all the missions there. Now you basically you keep rinsing and repeating that until you have your full maximum mission um, allowance. Now once you've done that you will find that um, you've got a ton of missions and they're all for the same particular target. Now the way that, that Frontier have decided the missions work is that one target counts for every single one of the missions so it's a really really quick way of getting through the missions you don't have to go and kill 89 only have to kill nine if that makes sense so i'm gonna carry on board hopping get as many missions as possible and i'll be back with you okay so once you've done that and you've got your full allotment of missions we're going to go out and we're going to go and complete them so i'm not going to bore you with the journey so i'm going to speed through this bit quite quickly um, but once we get to the um, Kent Horizons, uh, I'm going to launch my Taipan Fighter and I'm going to go out and I'm going to take out those targets. Now, there are a limited number of targets when you get there, and I do recommend that you have something with fixed weapons because you're not going to be able to target the skimmers without getting ridiculously close to them in whatever ship you happen to be in. And that's one of the reasons why I've chosen to use a Taipan Fighter in this particular instance. Now, you're taking the targets out, uh, as you can see here and I'm using the fixed pulse, um, plasma pulse repeater thing. And once you've done that, you'll get mission updates as you go. Now, something to bear in mind is that not all the missions have the same number of kills required, but there are a limited number of actual skimmers here in this location. So, as you can see there, I'm getting some mission updates. Now, once you've destroyed all the skimmers that are there, and you haven't completed your missions, Again, you're going to go and you can do a board hop. You're going to jump out of the game, change modes. I do recommend that you do it in private or in solo when you do that, because if you're an open play, the chances are there aren't going to be that many uh, skimmers available, because I'm pretty sure that you're not going to be the only person doing this particular method of making money. Now, each run you're looking to make easy, easy millions, and we're talking you know, 30, 40 million per run. And this can be completed in less than an hour. So it's really good money, it's really, really safe money as well. Now, you do have some options if you fancy getting a little bit more dangerous with it, in which case there are some other terminals there, some ground-based settlements, which do have security levels on them. And there's Noble Enterprise and... Um, some other horizon place as well now i've been sticking with this one just because it's really easy and it's quick and um, but the number of missions are kind of limited so if you wanted to you could potentially pick up loads for all of them and then go from one to one and that would potentially be quicker than the board hopping a lot more but there you go okay guys i want to thank everyone for watching i'm commander plater and um, this has been the quick money making guide for 2.2 and as I said before, you can do this in any single ship. Uh, please like, subscribe, all that kind of stuff, and do check out the rest of the videos on my channel. Thank you for watching. Commander Plater out.